I arrived here in 1990, and, um, and obviously I inherited a very, very strong program. But it was pretty obvious, even back then, that the physical plant was not going to be able to be sufficient for what we wanted to achieve. About 10 years ago, uh, Lankanol began to, to formalize its master facilities planning project, working with the community on how we could utilize this property uh, to its highest and best potential. This new building is the culmination of over 150 years of care at Lankanol, and it symbolizes our commitment to the present and specifically to the future. Well, it's another step in the hospital's evolution, its growth. We now have a facility which I think is commensurate with the skills of the people who will work in this facility. We have a long history of being the first. When we moved out to this campus in 1953, we were hailed as the hospital of the future back then. So we've done this before, and I really think we've once again uh, built the hospital of the future. So what we're trying to do with the opening of the Heart Pavilion is to really bring together all of the cardiac services that are provided on this campus and look at the best way to deliver that in a single location, complemented by our other hospitals and outpatient sites that partner with the Lankanal Heart Institute. All the cardiologists who work together, the heart surgeons, the vascular surgeons, we've all condensed into this beautiful brand new healing space. We're going to be able to evaluate the patient as a team, and that's really going to allow our patients to get a more comprehensive evaluation in a shorter period of time. All of us who had a role in designing this building decided that we had one overarching priority, and that was to take better care of our patients. The doctors, the nurses, the other team members were intimately involved with the planning and design of the building. I think that's very evident when you look at it. We brought probably over 100 nurses that work at Lankanol. They came in and we just brought them in and said, what, what makes sense? I've never seen rooms like these rooms anywhere in the entire world. I've been all over the place. It's dramatic. The rooms are private. They are spacious. The large windows will give them a daytime, nighttime differentiation, which is extremely important. The rooms are quiet, they're spaced far apart, the floors are soft, there's plenty of room for family. So when you're sick, you don't want to hear noise and you want your family there. Every room has a couch by the window that then can be pulled out to turn into a bed so that family members can stay overnight. I think it's wonderful to have an environment where the physician can interact not only with the patient, because the patient doesn't come alone, but as part of a family. The patient is at the center of the care that's being given. It's not the physician, it's not the nurse, it's not even the building itself, but it's the fact that the building places the patient right in the center. Each patient needs to feel that they're a human being who has a disease and not a disease attached to a human being. You can apply the best medicine and the best science, but if that patient doesn't feel comfortable, with their physician and their feeling that the physician cares about them, their healing is not going to be as good as it can be. I never thought I'd, I'd be the one to have the heart attack, but when I did, I ended up at the right place. Well, the care w was just first class, and, and the nurses, particularly uh, in intensive care, the uh, nurses in intensive care were awesome. They have skill, they have knowledge, but they also have the human element of being personal and caring, and you feel that, and I felt it every minute I was here. The pavilion's gonna be a glue to bring our great cardiac service line together. There is no way that we could have done this without our donors. I continue to be amazed at the level of commitment that our community has to Lankanaw. Healthcare is part of your life, and you invest in an institution that you think will be there for you, and Lankano, um, I think, makes a good case that it is that institution. And it's going to be a landmark. There's no place in the world that can compare to this. No place that I've ever seen. This facility, the way it's designed, the way it's going to be staffed, the way the delivery of care is going to occur, is only going to enhance the patient's experience. It's going to make them feel more welcome. It's going to make them feel more secure. It's going to lend to the healing that we're so desperately trying to provide.